Just a few years ago, I was a curious student like you. Today, I'm here to share my journey working at one of the world's biggest tech companies. You probably use Digital Wallet to pay for your expenses from your mobile phone every day. I'm one of the people who ensure these apps run smoothly. Hi, I'm Sujin. I'm a software engineer. Do software engineers work alone? That's a common misconception. While coding is a core part of my work, I spend a significant amount of time collaborating with designers, product managers, and other engineers. Strong communication skills are crucial for explaining technical concepts, providing constructive feedback, and ensuring that everyone is on the same page. Are women really better at art subjects and not math and sciences? That's actually a very harmful stereotype. Software engineering requires a blend of logical thinking and creative problem solving. And these skills are untied to gender. Anyone can excel in any field as long as they have the interest and dedication to learn. Does the hiring process at Google involve multiple rounds of interviews? This is a common practice for tech companies. All interview processes are designed to be thorough, giving both the applicant and the company a chance to assess if you are the right fit. During my interview with Google, I asked questions to engage with my interviewers. I then engaged and envisioned myself thriving in that environment. What's this? Hi, Zijin. I am Poodle, the AI dog bot from the Yummy Buddies with some wholesome enthusiasm. Oh wow, that's so cool. I fetch data faster than a frisbee, but my results might be a bit off. Can I sniff out some questions to dig up answers I can chew on? Yeah, of course. What exactly does a software engineer do? Mm, you can think of software engineers as the architects and builders of the digital world. We use our coding skills to design mobile apps, websites, and um, also complex systems that power businesses. So we usually start off with a concept or a problem, and then we leverage on technology to craft a solution. I see. What intrigued you to take on an engineering degree? Um, when I was little, I was fascinated by the process of building things, and I also really enjoyed the satisfaction of seeing what I built come to fruition. I was particularly drawn to NTU's Renaissance Engineering Program because of the versatility it offered. The skills acquired are applicable across various sectors and industries. And this really resonated with my desire in finding a career with diverse options and also room for growth. What previous work experience do you have? Um, so, this is actually my first job since graduation. I've been at Google for about four years now. I feel like I'm constantly learning and pushing my boundaries, especially when it comes to designing and building large-scale production features. So, um, for example, um, Google Pay, which is the product that I'm currently working on, has 150 million users globally. Knowing that a minor change for me could make a direct impact on millions of people is truly motivating to me. Wow! What challenges do you face at work? One of the biggest challenges is keeping up with how fast technology changes. Recently, I had to add a new feature using an unfamiliar framework, and this required a lot of self-directed learning. Another challenge is to deliver high-quality work despite tight deadlines, but I find this process very rewarding. It pushes me to be resourceful, adaptable, and a better problem solver. Terrific! Code languages could be easily generated by AI. Do you think you and the high will get replaced one day? Um, I know that's a common concern, but I believe AI will empower software engineers rather than replace them. Although AI can automate tedious tasks, the human touch remains crucial in solving complex issues ethically. So as engineers, we can adopt AI tools to increase productivity so that we can focus on other tasks. Ah, any advice for aspiring engineers? Um, for anyone wanting to become a software engineer, I would say start by building your foundation. Learn how to organize information in useful ways 
and to solve problems step by step. So, are you ready to embark on your journey?